A couple picks up a baby in the wild. The man tries to tease him, but gets a click and breaks his fingers. When they got home, the man shaved off the baby's beard. But when he turns around, the beard grows back. Palos is born with godly powers. But the doctor says he's normal. Not only can Palos lift a two-ton car, he can also peek at test answers with his see-through eyes. But people were afraid of him and wouldn't make friends with him 20 years past. And Palos disguised himself as an ordinary man. He only used his powers when he was alone. For example, using a coin to buy up all the snacks in the vending machine, or using his penetrating eyes to peek at his favorite female co-worker. Until one day, a subway went out of control. He moved quickly to the end of the line and created a cushion with a water pipe. However, when the subway arrived, He was quickly spotted. According to the inexplicable voice in his head, he arrives at a company. The owner of the company says she has created countless accidents all over the world just to draw him out. She tells Palos that they are all aliens and asks Palos to return to their planet with her, but Palos refuses. The parents tell Palos the truth. They found him in a spaceship. He opens the spaceship and his real father in the projection tells him the truth. When their planet was attacked by invaders, his parents sent him away to hunt down Palos. The invaders sent their own daughter, but in near-Earth orbit, Palos crashed into a satellite. This resulted in losing his coordinates. Learning everything, Palos decides to fight the bad guys. That's when the villains show up. Palos rushes to put on his battle suit, and his father covers him using a shotgun. Next, Palos beats up the villain mercilessly. In short, he beats the villain. Happy ending!